Hello and welcome to Workspace ONE 101, a free video training course on how to quickly configure and deploy Workspace ONE as a standalone enterprise mobility management solution. This video is brought to you by UEM Authority. Let's get started. In this video, you'll learn how to integrate Workspace ONE Access with your on-premises Active Directory. Doing this will synchronize existing users in Active Directory to Workspace ONE. Simplifying the enrollment process for end users by synchronizing known information, eliminating the need for you to create basic user accounts. Ongoing synchronization helps ensure information is always current and up to date. Using the Workspace ONE Active Connector and the Directory Sync service works well to synchronize users using a read-only connection to your on-premises Active Directory. Prerequisites Your operating system should be Windows Server 2012 or higher, and you should have installed the following software packages. AirWatch Cloud Connector, .NET Framework 4.8 or above, and Microsoft C++ Redistributable. Step one. First, we will add the Workspace ONE Access Connector before downloading the configuration file. Let's begin. From the Workspace ONE Access Console, click Identity and Access Management. In the top right, click Setup. Then click New. Select Workspace ONE Access Connector and click OK. Next click go to myvmware.com. Tap Download Now. Return to the previous screen to download the configuration file. Click Next. Enter the password before proceeding to download the configuration file. Once it's downloaded on the Windows server, right-click the file, then click Run as Administrator to install. I'll now guide you through the installation process. Click Next. Accept the terms and conditions and click Next. We'll be using the default settings, so click Next again. Select the configuration file and enter the password we just created. Select Default and tap Next. Please enter your domain account credentials and select the server. Great! Now click Install and wait for the process to finish. Tap Finish, and let's return to the browser to ensure the installation has been successful. Once the installation process is complete, it will be visible under Identity and Access Management. Great! With this, the Workspace ONE Access Connector has been downloaded and set up successfully. Part 2. In this next part, we will bind Active Directory to authenticate and authorize your users to access it. From the Workspace ONE Access Console, click Identity and Access Management. 
click Add Directory, then click Add Active Directory. Type your directory name, which is your fully qualified domain name. Scroll down and in the bottom part enter your bind user details. Then click Save and Next. Keep clicking Next until you click Sync Directory. Well done! We have successfully synced Active Directory in the Workspace ONE Access Console.